Hello and welcome back to another video. So this is actually new Resident Evil 2 news or it's basically like a rumor but I think it's pretty much confirmed. So basically it was discovered by True Achievements in the Microsoft Store on Xbox that there is going to be a playable demo for Resident Evil 2. There was actually a rumor that there was going to be a playable demo that was going to be released um, in this month December but it seems like the, de the demo could be releasing in January. Um, it seems like the demo will be released in January 11 and it'll be gone from the store January 31st. Now, this is only on Xbox One. Um, we're not sure if it's going to be on PS4, but apparently for the Resident Evil 2, it's called a one-shot demo. If you don't know what that means, basically, um, this is going to be a demo where you're going to be only able to play for 30 minutes, so one shot. And the cool thing is, is that if you die in the game, you can respawn or whatever, but you'll only have 30 minutes to play this demo and you can do whatever you want. You can either like check the atmosphere of the game or you can fight some enemies, progress the story I assume, um, uh, go through puzzles, so um, it's kind of like weird that I never heard of a one shot demo, a demo where you only play for 30 minutes and then it's gone. Demo. <laughs> like that's a weird thing. You'd assume they make a demo for like every player experience, but it seems like for the demo they want to make for the game and for Resident Evil 2, they really want to make a demo where anyone can do whatever they want, but it can only be for like one console and it can only be for like 30 minutes, so I find it really weird that they do this, um, because, um, what's the word? Like, this is the first, like, you imagine this would be like an actual thing like at E3, for example, because I'm pretty sure E3 does this type of stuff where you only have like a certain amount of minutes to play this demo or something but I find it kind of weird that they make a one shot demo so yeah um I'm not sure if you're gonna be able to play as Leon or Claire I'm assuming you get to choose maybe probably just Leon as default because I think he's kind of like the main character in a way probably not I don't know but yeah this is kind of weird that this demo they're making is gonna be a one shot demo and as I said before, I'm not sure if it's going to be on PS4, but for Xbox One, it's pretty much confirmed. So that won't be a problem for me because I have an Xbox One. But yeah, um, I'm kind of nervous to play the demo for next month, um, but it should be cool. So I'm hoping that it'll be fun. I think it'll be a fun experience. The only thing else like I said is 30 minutes. I wish it was like a demo where you could just replay over and over because I feel like those are kind of like, I don't want to say fun, but like I feel like that'd be kind of cool. That way you won't be feel... Uh, like, you won't feel pressure trying, like, what if you get stuck in the puzzle, and then you can't finish it because you, like, get stuck so badly and you barely did anything. So, like, that's, like, one thing I'm worried about, so, yeah. But, yeah, that's something they're doing for this Resident Evil 2, um, demo. I know there's, like, a Resident Evil 7 demo, and, of course, I would assume that they want to make one for Resident Evil 2, which would make sense, so, yeah. Um, are you guys, are you guys gonna play this demo? Are you guys sad that it's 30 minutes only? Do you guys wish it was, like, a shorter demo? Um... Let me, know, let me know what you guys think in, in the comment section down below because I'm really, I would love to hear your thoughts on this because I think this is like a cool concept but it kind of sucks at the same time if that makes sense but I can understand why the developers do it even though there'll literally be like hundreds of videos on YouTube where people literally record their demo of their playthrough so um yeah I think that's it. Anyways I'm gonna get going and go do stuff. Anyways I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Give it a like and subscribe it really means a lot and Thank you guys for um, supporting the channel, especially with Resident Evil 2 content. And yeah, I'll see you guys later. Goodbye.